Tausa also not sure it need. Not sure what that means, but it's probably good. Hey, I'm actually almost gonna be level 25. We've gotten a whole half of a level while we've been in here. And we've still got about half the chamber left. Uh oh, I'm not getting this heavy thrust working right. And what's our love in the treasure coffer? A vial of ether. We keep getting these vials of ether and like little bits and pieces here. Are those anything that really help us? Um, they're not major drops from treasure chests, but they're, you know, little bonuses. Okay. So it looks like the uh, Khaleesi just doesn't even roll on any of this stuff. So I'll totally find needing it then. Yep. Oh, oh dear, oh, this yeah. is icky, this is the sticky. Goop. The goo. Oh. Well, the goop has just taught me that it's very gooey. Yeah, and I cannot actually cast spells through the web. <laughs> now we know. Yeah. Yeah, don't stand in the goo. The goo slows me. Did it hurt? I'm not even sure if it hurt me though. No, it just makes you slow. Okay. That doesn't seem like the worst thing. Only when monsters are chasing you. Oh, this is the roll that I'm looking at. So it looks like it rolled for a 47 and a 15. So if anyone has a higher number than that, they will take it. This guy is stepping. There's a lightning sprite that just came out of nowhere. I don't know if the tank realizes that this lightning sprite is here. Sorry, Felia. I know you're gonna have to deal with that. Oh no, Khalees is gonna break through that sticky web. Oh, he's uh, readied it. There we go, now we can all walk through it. Yay! Kill the fleshy pods? <laughs> What? Kill the fleshy pods. Gross. Now don't let them wake up. Oh, it looks like we have... Oh, oh no! Boy. Yep. The sticky web pushes the tank through and then spawns. And so we have to kill it quickly or else the tank will be under attack without any backup. It's kind of clever. Hey, double, double win. I don't think now is a good time to get dressed. Hey, you got a shirt. Yep. I got a new battle dress, I believe.
So it looks like being in the green goop gives me this purple aura underneath, but other than that, it just reduces speed. It doesn't actually damage us. That is correct. So I'm trying to wonder what the tactical purpose of it being here is. It works against us with those spider webs, but those don't do a whole lot. Like, that wasn't too big of a threat to just have that pop up somewhere, but maybe they're leading up to something bigger? I think it's possibly just a preparation for things to come. Hmm. Like, you realize, oh, if I stand in this stuff, it's bad. And then later on, you're expected to know that some things, if you stand in them, are bad. Oh, like... Oh, that's bizarre. Like, really bad, sometimes. Ugh, I don't like super close. Come on, baby. There we go. This is, this is a mite trap. So they have this whole ecosystem down here. Mites and mite traps. And the pitcher plants that are just big light bulbs in the dungeon. I'm worried that they're, they're having us kill all these fleshy pods that just explode in one hit. And now they're going to start hiding them places. Like landmines. Okay, so I thought we'd be doing this a whole bunch more, but it looks like the next thing is just to open the abs abassination chamber door. Which means our last thing is probably to kill whatever's in the abassination chamber door. Which saves us a lot of time. I thought we'd have to kill, do two more of these big terminal thingies. Yeah, but we've, uh, we've transitioned into a very different area of the dungeon. I barely even uh, recognize that this is the same place as where we just were. It seems like the only main thing that's actually the same between these areas is the eggs, so it's almost like the eggs were designed into this dungeon just to serve as a common set piece between these other different settings that they wanted to create. Hmm. I think that's a really good point. Just a clever design trick. Uh, and uh, also the shape of our dungeon has evolved from being straight lines into being these big curving areas. Oh, something keeps exploding. Fleshy pods, I bet. Taos, uh, Khaleesi's just having, having a great time blowing stuff up. Hey, here's our chamber door. Oh, fleshy pods. Look. Yeah, but this whole place is, uh, seems to have melted. So while we had this really bland, uh, like, very generic square shapes dungeon, uh, built, built into a prison... Now it's like, this is something way different. Yeah, it's become a little bit more organic. Oh, sticky web. Bingo. That's exactly what I was thinking. It's got this vitality to it. The goo that rains down the hallways. No, don't attack me. No, little mighty. There you go. Attack, attack the Power Ranger in the middle. Everyone hates Power Rangers. Sad to say, I must admit right now that uh, until about five minutes ago or so, I realized I was uh, doing my rotation exactly backwards. Oops. <laughs> That actually might be a major reason why uh, we weren't killing things fast enough. Ah. 
Also, check your yeah. positioning. Some things require certain positions to be yes, the most effective. Yes, yes. No, I, I had my positions backwards, so uh -huh. I was heavy thrusting when I was supposed to impulse drive, and vice versa. Which means I lost about... Um... 200% of the damage that I could have been doing. Or 100%. So I could have been doing twice as much damage this whole time. I just wish there was a sweet spot where I could be both behind and at the flank of the enemy. There kind of is. They, there is a, a kind of an angle where it's just a step to the left or the right to go between flanking and... Uh, which is a side attack and then a back attack. I've been trying to find that sweet spot, but I could never, never hit it quite right. Uh-oh. It does not know battle. Help me out, buddy. Oh my. Oh hey! Yeah, it's dark and pointy guy. Or is this a new guy? <laughs> nah, this is the same guy. Yep. I remember you. I should probably catch up. What, you don't like the language I speak? You can, you can lay off, dude. Me, 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 me. There's only one true god. Well, there's there's lots of gods, so you gotta get over yourself. Yours is a most fantastical tale, truly oh. absorbing. For a villain, you're very flattering. It is a tale to tell Eorzea's children before bedtime, and it will soon be dark and bring them the light. Oh, thank you. I think. <laughs> Oh, I think that's Team Me. That's the Echo. Wow. Laha Brea, I like you more than I like most of my friends. Why can't my friends be nice to me like Laha Brea is? Oh. Well, things have come for a turn of the worst. Yeah, this is some evil magic stuff going on here. Is but the beginning of another, the tale of the crystal's demise. Okay, show me the big stuff. Let's do something. Do some real magic now. Become a dragon or become David Bowie. There we go. Goma fight for the win. He just Power Rangered that Goma into being super big. Okay, sorry, I'm here now. All right. Yep, this guy's gonna summon a lot of little ads, kill them quickly, and the pods. Yeah. Okay. Ads before boss. Rinse and repeat. Kill the pods for the damage dealers. White Mage 2, if you have spare arrow to keep them clear. Oh, are they going to be far away from me? Yeah, they're going to be spread out around the perimeter. Oh, hello. Do I poke at them? 
They're going to hurt me if I poke at them. I'm not going to poke at them. <laughs> I should have known that they would explode and hurt me if I poked them. Yeah, it's unfortunately on all of our magic dealers to use arrow in uh, our white mage's case and use some black magic to hit those from a distance. Yeah, it looks like even the tank is getting in some of the action. Yep. <laughs> I'm so okay. useless. Uh, just kill the big guy. Kill the big guy. And don't stand in that. <laughs> yep. Oh, hi there. You love me. Yeah, this is where love you... Love me not. Oh, Talsa, no. Uh-oh. Yeah, we haven't been uh, killing the ads very quickly. Oh! Uh, no. No, we're gonna get you. There we go. Okay, so ads are done. Okay. At least for now. Look at me. Stay away. Oh, the skin has fallen off Graffiti's tail. And Graffiti made some oh. icky stuff. Kill the tail. Kill the tail? Yes, but you it's can target there. it separately now. Whoa, whoa, whoa. I'm, I'm killing the tail. And that green stuff looks like bad news. Yeah, don't stand in that, and limit break. <gasps> oh, we have a limit break. Ready? Yeah. Limit break a go-go. Do a little dance for me, Graffiti. Nice. Oh, I've got... I can't get behind him, so I'm gonna... There we go. <laughs> change my rotation a little bit so I use my main stuff, but, uh, yeah, it's over now. Never mind. Woo! Duty complete, got a level up out of it, and got a whole bunch of new clothing. No more... Right on. Yay! Yeah, I picked up a level two, so that is definitely appreciated. A level two? Oh, you got a new level, yeah. Uh, or a level as well. Yeah. Level 27. And a bow! <laughs> Not that anyone is really in need of a bow, but... Yeah, it's a bow of owls, so that's kind of cool. Not as cool as a bowl of owls, but, you know. Oh, you could have an entire bowl of owls. That would be awesome.